Hello everyone and welcome, I am Eddie and we are playing Fallen Enchantress. So we now have quite a few cities and I think they are all uh, connected. Uh, okay, except this one, but it will be soon. Uh, let's take a look here at our kingdom. Okay, so we have only one level 2 city for now and a lot of uh, villages. Yes, we have six settlements. Uh, and yes, we have met three factions so far. So Rezon is friendly, also has uh, six settlements. Uh, Gaji also friendly, uh, but only has four settlements. At a very high power rating. Uh, Rezon is a little bit lower in terms of power rating. And attack only has uh, three settlements and uh, yes, it's fairly high power rating also. So attack is probably um, going to be our main concern uh, for now because um, well, first there's uh, they are an empire uh, faction while uh, we are a kingdom faction. And also, they ha they are very close to to us, so uh, they might declare war on us uh, fairly soon. And uh, one of the problems we have is that um, the way I design them, uh, they will have units uh, with a, a lot of defense, so. Uh, one of the way to counter that uh, would be to uh, to create uh, units that um, uh, use uh, elemental range attack, like uh, well, that use elemental um, elemental damage. So maybe range uh, range unit that use uh, ice and incineration staffs. Maybe some ice spear or something. So I'll have to. Um, I think I'll have to go that way pretty fast. Okay, so what were we doing? Um, so Camus was uh, coming to the lair of the water shrills. Okay, I think we were going uh, that way and back up to get some uh, uh, leather experiment for uh, Zved's army. Okay, so we finished the uh, shard harvesting. Alright, one other thing, if we want to be able to create um, a lot of units u using uh, magical equipment, we are going to need a lot of crystals. So... I'm going to start with Ritual and then I'm going to go to Glyphstone to get um, uh, the Crystal Mine and the Crystal Trove because right now our uh, Crystal um, resources only produce uh, 0.5 Crystal per turn so 
And we have finished another Spearman. Yeah, so right now we have... Um, I'm actually going to have him come here. And same for him. All right, and so you are not uh, doing anything. And yes, we can upgrade uh, quite a few. Uh, uh, all uh, so three shrines here. But I also need some money, and I would like uh, to increase um, the population cap here. I mean, we have... Um, uh, it was a fairly low grain. Uh, this was three grain. That would be another 30 population only. It wouldn't allow us to get to level 3, but uh, maybe once I um, some of my other towns level up, uh, other villages level up, I'll make some towns and uh, increase the, the faction for food per grain. So I'm going to start with a granary. Wait, uh, I still need to make some spearmen. I have... Uh, I have two en route, three, four. Okay, I have like six uh, spearmen en route. So actually, that should be okay for now. So let's uh, let's take the time to improve uh, our capital. So granary. Merchant and the shrines. Okay. We still um, we haven't met uh, many uh, heroes we can recruit. I don't think we met uh, any at all. I'd love to have a third hero to get a third army. We probably wouldn't have the money to uh, recruit him now, but... Uh, and we have enemies... Uh, okay, the walls. So we finished the spearman here. Yeah, we did see a few uh, heroes, but they are mostly Empire ones, like uh, here. Okay, so the water tsunami from this uh, layer is uh, around here. Oh, and the last library. might be a bit dangerous to go pick it up actually because uh, the Darkling's army uh, right next to it. But we have uh, another spot for a city. 
So we have at le actually several of them. So yes, I'm going to need to produce a few a few settlers. Oops. Okay. All right, and we finished uh, another couple of set of uh, spearmen. What is going on? For some reason, uh, to go from here to here, and uh, she's going all the way around. I guess it's probably because we don't have a road uh, in between here, unfortunately. Okay, so we created a monument here. So that should link our cities. Uh, next turn. Okay, we still have walls here. We're going to need to address them. So let's take care of the water shrills. Uh, whoops. Okay, so... Yes, they have slow... Otherwise we should be good. I don't think I'm going to waste any mana on them. Okay, that should be... Um, finished uh, quite uh, easily. Alright. And we level up. Uh, so, Fire Mage, Water Mage, Air Disciple. I think I might take uh, Air Disciple. Uh, for um, the spell uh, Thunder, it's a tactical spell that um, uh, damages elementals uh, for 5 damage per level of the caster, so it uh, 
it scales uh, very well with uh, the level and it's uh, really very effective uh, especially against um, uh, armies that um, for example the fire lords armies can be extre extremely difficult to to fight because um, the fire lord unit is uh, incredibly pro powerful but uh, with a spell like thunder you can kill it uh, rather um, easily and then the rest of its army it's a lot easier to take care okay let's see okay the other army has gone so let's uh, I'm not sure if that what I just did um, is actually useful, but what I'm thinking is in case the, the 20 research I get from... Oh, the Dark Enemy right on top of it. Oh, okay, so I won't be able to take it. Uh, but in case the 20 research uh, I take uh, from the last uh, library uh, exceeds uh, what's left in uh, rituals, I'm not sure it will um, uh, go over to the next technology or not. Uh, oh, and it's here, not. Uh Alright, so no, let's finish ritual first. Um, so, just in case I queue up uh, the next tech. Oh, and I'm... no, I can't come here. So I'll go take the Spearman and come back and clean this up. Okay, so... Yeah, here to create a road uh, on this side that might actually have to to create uh, an outpost around here. And then research, uh, yes, it's the economics uh, tech to get roads to outposts. Okay, so we finish rituals. And I'm going for glyph stones for the crystal trove. Okay, and so we met another uh, Another civilization, another faction, which is Starth. And for some reason, I just gained vision over this. I have no clue why. Oh, it's my caravan. Okay. So yes, we have uh, an economic treaty with uh, attack, I believe. And so um, you have a, a caravan going back and forth. Well, actually two caravans, I think. One from me and one from attack. And they're going back and forth between our capitals. And so they give me vision uh, over uh, the territory here. So attack capital is probably around there and let's check out um, Tarth so they only have one settlement they have a fairly low power rating they are actually uh, at our level they 
Yes, they are neutral towards us. Yes, in the attack they consider us uh, weak. And they are still settling, so... Once uh, they are done, I'll have to be careful. Alright, so here... Um, I'm going to build, I think, a few pioneers. And I can build a city here. And here. I wonder... Okay, five to zero because I have I know I have a lo lot of spots where I can uh, create towns out of my villages. Uh, but what do I have uh, that I could make into? Um, conclaves. So this one is uh, my fortress. Three four zero nope. Six three two. Rita, so that could be a conclave. Okay, so uh, so far only Rita, which was I think up there, yeah. Okay, so eighteen more pop. Uh, we get there at 1.2 per uh, per turn, so Let's see, does he already has? Yes, so... Okay, so this one is better, of course. Let's sell... Okay, yes, what are we using? We have a spur. And yeah, we don't have anything uh, better yet. I'm not going to buy him anything for now. I don't understand what they're doing. There's a big uh, passing passing problem right now. And we have the spearman here also. I 
and might uh, put them in this city. Okay, and we have spearmen here also. So let's um, manually try to move them. Um, Okay, we still have the walls here. Um, yeah, I'm not going uh, to equip it since I have the spear. Okay, we finished training another spear unit. Finish to cleric here. Merchant, merch. Uh, no, very okay. Oh yes. Also, I wanted to check uh, for our crystal. So we only have uh, one crystal mine, which is here. So I'm going to make sure I'm going to upgrade it as soon as possible. And I think there was another crystal crag somewhere. Yes, here. So I'm going to have to build a, a city as soon as possible. Which means I'm going to need to clear this uh, Great Wolf Den. Maybe it's because the river crossing uh, stops the, the movement of the spearmen, so the automatic um, pathing uh, doesn't like this or something. So trade treaty with uh, Tarth. Yeah, I'm going to agree to it. So the trade treaty uh, gives us a 10% bonus in income, both uh, to us and Tarth. So that's uh, okay. Right, so I'm going to first build a city here, I believe. Before I go there. So I'm going to go, go have to go wide around the Siltskath uh, army.
I'm going to come back up with uh, camos. Okay, studded color. Okay, that's pretty good. So, we finally got our four uh, spearmen here. I think we have a fifth uh, on the way. Oh, yes, he's here. So, once again, let's. Um, Move him uh, manually. All right. Okay, and uh, we have uh, our second level two city. So no essence. Um, four materials, three food. I'm going to make it a uh, town uh, to start um, increasing uh, the faction food uh, per grain. And we finish the farm here. And I might actually start uh, training a couple of. Um, Pioneers here also. Uh, let's see, it doesn't have a very high production. Yeah, I'll produce uh, pioneers here instead, and here I'm going to. Yeah, we still have some unrest. So I will go for the town hall. Okay, and uh, we will continue um, our game in the next episode since uh, our time ran out. Thank you for watching, don't forget to like, favorite, comment and subscribe. Thank you and see you later.